Hey guys, Kellen here with Droid Life. So we're taking a look today at the Pixel 2 XL display. There's been some complaints about it and we just wanted to address some of it. So we've got the V30 here and also the regular Pixel XL from last year. And we toggled sRGB mode off on the Pixel XL because we actually believe it is on on the 2 XL and Google's actually buried the setting and won't let us turn it off. So if we go ahead and turn sRGB on though on the XL, you can see the color profile essentially match. Now there's a little bit more pop on the 2XL and I say that because there is a vivid colors toggle that might slightly tweak it, though it's not that extreme. If we get close up here, you can see with sRGB off, that Chrome icon has a nice red pop as well as the Instagram icon compared to the 2XL, which just, again, looks kind of dull. If we flip that to on then, you can see then it now matches. And again, you can really see it there with the Instagram icon. So if we jump out and look from Droid Life, the pink is the big tell here, as well as some of the grassy areas. And if again, if we flip to sRGB on, that pink just kind of dies and then it matches that of the Pixel 2 XL. So the vibrancy here really just goes away on the 2 XL. And, and again, we think it's an sRGB on issue and they've just buried that. So it'd be nice if they would maybe unlock that feature. Now, this other big issue here is we've heard about this tilting thing where the display essentially turns a bluish tint if you're not looking at it directly. And well, you can see that here. So if you're looking directly, the display actually looks kind of warm to my eye, but if you turn it at all to the side, it kind of, yeah, just goes a little bit blue right away. And, and, it, and it's noticeable immediately. And, and so even if you turn it backwards, you can see it actually sort of gradually goes from blue to the top and it's still kind of warm and then you keep getting that angle and it gets bluer and bluer. It, it, it's kind of a weird effect. Again, I've used the phone for over a week now and it has not driven me nuts. I look at my phone directly, but it, it is there. I do believe it's a panel issue though. Here's the LG V30, which probably has the exact same panel and you can see it does the exact same thing. You turn it a little bit to the left or right or backwards and uh, yeah, you get a blue tint in there. So it, it is an issue. I, I, I'm not denying that it's not an issue. It just depends on whether or not you think it's going to be an issue for you or not. And again, you can see here as we tilt it back, same deal. It looks nice and warm and colorful here. You start tilting it back and it immediately gets that blue tint. Now, one of the things on the V30 is you can see like the pink and droid life pops a little bit more, whereas it's a little more lifeless on the 2XL. And we again think that's an sRGB issue. Here it is next to last year's Pixel XL with sRGB mode off. So you've got that vibrant color. You also do not get any of that color shifting in this AMOLED panel. You can see there it holds that sort of warmish tone and does not get that bluish color that you are seeing here on the Pixel 2 XL. So just keep that in mind. If you get a Pixel 2 XL and you tilt it and shift it, this is going to happen. If you look at it from an angle on a desk, this is going to happen. I'll let you decide if that's a deal breaker or not.